Hello again, friends. And you are our friends. And welcome back to another edition of Jim Cornette's Drive Through, right here, wherever it is that you've pulled up to on this lovely day. <laughs> I am your host, the great Brian Last. And of course, on this show, we answer your questions. With well, hold on eight- now, cowboy. Now, hold on now. On the, we normally do, but you know what we're here to do. Don't try to put all this heat on me there, sunshine. Um, what we're doing here is we're letting people know that I have had a sudden and last minute change in my professional schedule and our original recording time. It's chaos here this week, folks. Uh, the, the original recording time was switched and it is going to be switched again. Um, I'm trying to get ready to leave town for an unexpected trip to do something that I cannot tell you what it is because I haven't done it yet. And it's a surprise, but by the time that you hear this, I will have done it and you'll have heard about it, but I don't want to tell you what it is because if I have a flat tire on the way there and don't do it, I don't want to look like an idiot. However, the point is they are our friends, Brian. You said that they are our friends until they possibly get the news that we're not doing a full length show today. But we didn't want to leave anybody hanging. So we, we are sending out this update on the drive through that indicates that by the time you hear this, I will have made a live appearance somewhere that will have gotten some notoriety. And because of the travel to and from that, I was not able to record a full length drive through. But we are here to tell you that this Thursday on the experience, not only will we talk about Michael Cohen spilling his guts because that's happening as we speak. But also, we will talk about my live appearance and involvement in the uh, production of Same that I was involved with. So that's going to be uh, this week on The Experience and so much more. But we didn't want to just have everybody going, where's the fucking drive through where's the drive through and milking them endlessly on something they weren't going to get, sort of like people that are expecting a quality television program from Raw and, and just get milked forever on it. Well, this is a big development, and I think people will learn once this comes out. This is big news. And I got to say, when I was growing up in Long Beach, New York, if you had told me that one day I'd be doing a podcast with the new booker for All Elite Wrestling, I would have been Oh, would you, oh, would you stop? No, would you just stop? Now, do not spread. <laughs> do not spread vicious, unfounded rumors. Because <laughs> the last thing that we want is any bookers affiliated with rumor and innuendo. That's right. That's right. Uh, but anyway, but yes, folks, uh, the experience last week, we reviewed SmackDown and uh, got uh, quite a bit of great response. Uh, we will be back with the drive through next week as scheduled. We'll be back this Thursday with the experience as scheduled. But I, I'm only one man and a lot of last minute preparations had to be made. And so anyway, with that, I'm, I'm going to be like one of those, uh, the first guest on the Tonight Show in the old days when it was a big star, and I'm going to leave instead of sitting here with the rest of the riffraff on the panel. You, Brian, can do what you want. Well, I think I may leave too. So uh, on that note, ladies and gentlemen, until Thursday on The Experience for Jim Cornette, I'm the great Brian Last, an abbreviated tally-ho.